Imagine a missile that leaps faster than sound, suddenly. That is hypersonic flight racing at five times the speed of sound or more. How can such a beast slice through air and stay hidden? In this video, we'll unveil its secret stay to the end. The key to high speed is always cutting frontal air resistance. Designers slim the body, so shock waves are fully deflected. A conical nose spreads heat, so the tip never burns. Advanced composite layers build a thermal shield within the frame. Now to propulsion the heart that drives those breathtaking velocities. Hypersonic weapons usually follow two mainstream propulsion paths. First, the glide vehicle missile, like a dove it climbs, then dives. Second, the hypersonic cruise missile that burns supersonic air in a scramjet. A glide vehicle accelerates like a ballistic missile into high altitude. Then, its warhead separates and slips inside the upper atmosphere. Gliding like the space shuttle, it skims the horizon for kilometers. Its zigzag course makes radar tracking hard and reaction time short. The cruise version with a scramjet flies in atmosphere from launch. Scramjets burn hypersonic air without slowing it inside the engine. No compressor blades means less weight and controllable combustion heat. Steady thrust allows constant maneuver and extended range. But speed without precision is useless. Navigation is vital. An inertial system with laser gyros measures angle and acceleration. Multiband GNSS receivers catch faint signals even under plasma. Data fusion trims the course, shrinking target error to meters. At hypersonic speed, air ionizes into plasma and blazes. Plasma disrupts radio links, yet the missile has answers. Low frequency channels and dead reckoning memory bridge the outage. Millimeter wave sensors spot targets through AI neural networks. Maneuverability is the edge an unpredictable path confuses defenses. Tiny fins plus thrust vector jets tweak the angle of attack. Minute inputs at Mach 5 shift the downstream flow dramatically. Each motion shortens and limits enemy radar lock-on windows. Skin temperatures can approach 2000 degrees Celsius. Titanium alloys with carbon coatings absorb that heat unchanged. Carbide carbon fibers keep the structure light yet ultra-resistant. Foam beneath the skin spreads temperature and eases stress. The next big question, how do you even detect it? High speed shortens radar horizons and delays warning time. Infrared glare is intense but offers only seconds to react. Multi-layer space-to-ground defenses are today's sole viable shield. Fire a missile a thousand kilometers, what happens? At Mach 5, the distance vanishes in just seven minutes. Ground radars may have barely two minutes to respond. That tiny window is a massive strategic lever for deterrence. Inside, a flight computer processes mission commands in real time. Behind the nose, an active AESA radar updates target maps. An IR seeker homes on an engine plume or runway heat. Faults are analyzed instantly and new routes chosen without pause. Hypersonics launch from submarines, ships, aircraft, or road trucks. Ground launchers usually provide solid fuel boost for the first stage. Beyond thin air, the booster drops and the glide body coasts. If it's a cruise type, the scramjet lights and accelerates immediately. Warheads weigh less than ballistic cousins, yet kinetic energy is higher. Some variants skip explosives, sheer velocity is destructive enough. Others carry precise, small charges for pinpoint strikes. Smaller warheads free room for extra fuel or sensors. Developing such systems is costly, hypersonic wind tunnels are pricey. Every test launch burns millions and yields mountains of data. Exotic materials are scarce, straining global supply chains. These hurdles spur both international cooperation and fierce rivalry. Defense scientists pursue lasers to scorch skins mid-flight. Hypersonic interceptors with ramjets will need even faster reactions. High-altitude X-band radars promise earlier cues and tracking. 
AI lets command centers decide in mere milliseconds. Hypersonics upend the familiar balance of nuclear deterrence. Policymakers must craft proportional answers without escalation. Hotline protocols gain new urgency to prevent miscalculations. Rivalry might yet spark cooperative rules under international law. Arms control experts propose treaties limiting range and speed. Verification is tricky because launchers can be dual use. The technology's nature complicates export controls and knowledge caps. Still, transparent talks could curb tomorrow's cost-heavy arms race. Hypersonic research offers wide civilian gains too. Heatproof shells could return cargo from orbit cheaply. Scramjets might whisk passengers worldwide in just two hours. Lightweight materials can build safer, more efficient electric cars. Some call hypersonics invincible, but no system is absolute. New tech hides flaws that only time will expose. Sky-high costs limit mass production and continuous deployment. Claims of total invincibility are therefore overstated. Reality is balanced. Future work focuses on active fuel-based skin cooling. AI algorithms will chart low drag routes at optimum speed. 3D printed models accelerate when tunnel test cycles. Each tweak can add precious seconds to defenders' reaction times. Several nations run active hypersonic programs, Iran, Russia, China, and more. Each picks distinct glide or scramjet design philosophies. Public tests reveal few technical details, yet competition intensifies. Multi-billion budgets hint breakthroughs are close on the horizon. As accuracy rises, anti-city roles may cede to surgical strikes. The global community must set ethical bounds on such arms. Existing laws like the Hague may need urgent new clauses. Open debate can illuminate the human stakes of radical tech. We've learned how hypersonic speed is gained and steered. Glide vehicles and scramjets each bring unique strengths and risks. Defense will blend radar, space assets, lasers, and AI. Research continues, final answers are still to come. Want to glimpse the future of warfare and technology? Subscribe. Don't miss our next deep dive into scramjet rockets. Your likes and comments help the algorithm share thrilling stories. Until next time, high speed, calm minds. Farewell, tech-loving friends.